Hey guys, how's it going? It's Hyde here, and we're back with a brand new episode of Factor Y. And in the last episode, we set up our first modules over here. So we've got one set up for belts, another one set up for belts, and this one actually makes us the splitter belts. And then we've got one set up for pickers. What the heck are those things called? I forget arms and we got one set up for miners now what we want to do today is start getting a factory set up for copper probably stone maybe get some more assembly machines going and see where we end up right now it looks like everything's pretty full though so that's pretty good now how do we want to do this we should have enough miners I hope to start building we only have nine available is this thing not working four iron plates eight out of four i think it is working it's just slow yeah yeah okay it is working that's good that is very good so we've got nine available we should have 10 here right away if this thing's working properly perfect okay so that is working exactly like we want it to so we got to start getting some copper set up and also some smelting for the copper. Hmm, I'm trying to figure out the best way to do this. So if I do something like this, it's not going to be pretty, but it should at least get us a whole bunch of copper. I don't know. It's not the worst right it could be it could be worse for sure so let's get some picker arms we're gonna do something like this and then as far as the conveyor belt i guess i may as well do all of the one direction first okay so we got something like this and we also want position already occupied there's a way we can set that to override add remove uh actually maybe not that's just actually just selection okay so let's just delete that so i bring the copper down this way i think that's gonna work out okay and then we're gonna want the copper we need two four five two four five so we gotta somehow get copper into this row and i think the easiest way to do that is probably oh that's what this is add yeah 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 okay we want to delete all that and whoa okay and then we're gonna go something like something like this i think that looks not bad. So now if I copy these guys, we're going to need to make sure we leave room for the outputs. So we'll do something like that. I don't know. Four seems like a decent number to get started with. That's what we were using before. So do something like that. Let's get some of these arms going. And I guess it doesn't really matter where I put them right now. So there we go. Let's get some crossing belts. And we'll do something like this something like this we're going to need to copy these uh yep that looks good so in 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 whatever out 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 okay now we've got ourselves i hope some copper that looks good okay we're making some copper perfect you love to see it now there is a bit of a problem in the fact that my copper is way over here i kind of want it like up over here i think i don't know i guess we could oh i can't split it can i okay you know what we're gonna do i'm going to add a belt like this we are going to actually delete this so if i do this those should merge good and then I can set up a new factory like this. How do we make more of these things? Actually, we're going to need more. 
let's see okay so this is gonna take stone bricks and gears Ooh, that's not the best we don't have stone bricks yet so we're gonna need another one of these factories man the only coal i have is this coal that is really not very good is it oh boy well you know what we can do we can take this and we can just run it all the way over to our stone factory why not <laughs> i don't know if this is a good idea or not but here we are so there we go we've got some stone i'm gonna need some more smelters we don't have any more for now so we're gonna have to stick with two which i guess is fine maybe i might need more copper miners too at some point is five enough to keep up i don't think it does so okay uh, not copper coal i meant so we might need some more of those at some point but for now at least this will get us started and we can work from there and i think i actually want to delete these and move them over one more okay then we can get that extra one in perfect let's get these guys going and send them on their merry old way into here okay something like that we're gonna need outputs output output perfect we're gonna have some stone we've already got iron and is that all we need to make more laboratories stone and iron plates oh, iron gears okay you know i just realized we we already have this machine here i may as well there we can have two going if this thing's plugged up because we're reached the maximum number of splitters then it can just take the outputs and shove them into there i think that's not a bad deal and i was just thinking about it some more and i think maybe what i'll do instead of this to save one of those is go like this all right i think that's better maybe i don't know so are we able to smelt stone i actually don't know i think that's how we get the stone bricks let's see how that works and then yeah that looks good yeah, that looks good okay we've got some little stone bricks being made we can add more later once we have the resources which is good now we're going to need a bunch of gears and i guess i don't need any of this right now so we'll get rid of that and then should i just bring the iron around and down here i'm just gonna build over top of this copper i think for now and maybe we can reorganize some stuff later but if i bring that around let's move this thing out of the way too I bring that around we're gonna have copper pretty close by i can put us a, a crossing belt we're gonna have stone we're gonna have iron i think that's not bad we'll have all of the things that we need pretty close i just man we're gonna need a whole bunch of belts aren't we this is gonna take a while Ooh, buddy okay well let's get started we're going to need a factory for gears which i wonder if i should just make that a module or not Eh. you know what for now let's just make gears out of this thing i'm gonna just put put them in here we will make ourselves some gears make sure we change that to the right thing all right that looks good and then what do we need another one of these for Ooh, you know what if i move this up just a touch more i can auto feed right out of that and into this one okay so we'll do something like this this guy is actually going to be set to assemblers because we're going to need more of those and that's going to take gears and stone bricks bingo okay so we're going to want another one of these what's the limit 50 that seems like a lot let's go with 30 
instead. And we'll copy that like that. Okay, so that should start making us factories or assemblers. What else do we need? Furnace burners? Yeah, we're gonna need those. So what does that take? Furnace burner just takes eight stone brick. That's easy. Easy peasy. So if I stick this right here. And dang, I wish I could use this for more than one item. I think I can. You know what? Let's move this over. Three. Like so. And copy this over to here. I can copy this over to here. Delete, delete. Okay. That looks good. Copy that over there. And there we have it. This is going to make us furnace burners. Mark one. Whoops. Okay. So there we go. That's going to make us furnace burners. Which once we have more of those, we'll be able to upgrade this system, which is good. I guess I should be copy and pasting that a little bit to help out. Okay. That looks not bad. It takes 32 seconds to make one furnace burner. So that's a while, but this is going to be running all the time. So that's fine. We're going to end up with a bunch of those. Okay. We've got both of those being automated. What else do we need more of if we're going to start advancing? I think that's it. We're making all of the like miscellaneous. We're not making labs, but I don't know if we need to. How do I make a lab? Iron plate, copper plate. Oh, eight chips, four wires. And how do we make those? Where are those? I guess we probably have to come into here. Um, here we go. Is this wire? Wire takes a copper plate and a chip takes a wire and an iron plate. Okay. So to make one chip, we need a copper plate and an iron plate. Oh, there it is. One iron plate, half a copper plate. Does this make two? Oh, it does make two. Okay. Well, no, we're running out of power. That's a problem. That is a huge problem. We have no coal making it down here right now. Okay, we're going to need more miners. Can I do that right now or am I going to be out of power? I think I'm going to be out of power. We're getting dangerously close. Hang on. Let's get some more miners going, see what happens. Maybe I can power up a couple extra ones. And then maybe we can build a few more of these guys. See how that goes for us. It's not bad. At least it's a start. Okay, we might need even more power here right away. I don't know if that's going to be enough. I'm going to find a better way to make power. You know what I should be doing? I should be setting up a whole separate mine for power. So let's just take this whole thing. Oh, this is going to be bad. If I do that, I'm going to run myself right out of power. Okay, if I take all of this, delete. Oh boy, I know, I know, I know game, I know. We'll put this over here. I think what we do is delete all this. Because it was working mostly before. Delete that. And we're going to bring this over here to power those guys. And I may as well build however many I can. Whoops. Okay, that's all we can build for now. But that should be enough to get the other ones moved. And then once we move them like that. Okay, let's get let's let, make sure this is all powered up once it's fully powered. I should be able to delete all of these and copy them and paste them right up here. All right, let's try it. See how it goes. Oh, here we go. Okay, copy that. Put this right here. There we go. That looks good. Ooh, that looks good. Okay, we're going to need more of these burners as well. Uh, what does that take? Burner. 
burner 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 here we go eight stone brick okay let's just take the same thing as this other one so we can copy this uh, let me put this down copy this over copy this over change this to burners and then i'm going to just reuse that same that same output right there like so okay so that should make us burners uh assemblers no the melters whatever the heck these things are and fabricators you love to see it we should hopefully be sending enough coal to run all of our machines mm, maybe not quite enough maybe we need a couple more of these guys i know it's not going to be totally efficient because they kind of ran out of room but it's better than nothing so let's just put these things down wherever they can fit for now how's this doing actually i think we're gonna need more on this side as well those things take a lot of fuel holy cow now i don't know if i necessarily need a module for laboratories because like how many of these are we actually going to need you know I mean, I say that we're probably going to need a lot at some point, but if I can just get something that's gets going and gets it started, I think that's going to be half the battle. So let's get four wires. First things first, do I have enough? Oh, good. We can start making some wires. But I don't know where I want to do this. Maybe we want to do it on this side. Eh, let's do it over here. Let's make wires. So this is going to make us wires. We're going to go in here. Make sure this is set to wire. Okay, that is going to come out. And go this way. And then what? We need iron. Oh, I don't really have a good way to get iron. Unless I copy this over to here and we delete all of this. Okay. Something like that is maybe a little bit better for us. So we can actually get some iron over here. What else am I trying to do? What else am I trying to do? We need to make chips, which is a wire and an iron plate. And then the actual laboratory itself is a chip and a wire. Okay, so we're gonna need to combine this and this to make chips and then we need another one of those With the output of the other one to get that. Oh my god. I, I might be just confusing everybody. Let's see. I'm gonna need to combine this With an iron but Where do I want to do that? Where do I want to do that on this side? Maybe I'll do it on this side. I don't know Okay, let's combine this with some iron and i'll bring that under Ooh, i'm not gonna have enough belts for this i am not going to have enough belts for this oh it's so close though how are my factories doing are you guys doing okay oh yeah they'll get there they'll get there okay so once that's done this is going to make us chips we're going to need to output that into another factory which is also going to take this as a product and i think that should just about do it is this good or bad i don't know put this here or we're gonna need this here i'm gonna need this over here and this is going to be making us laboratories. Okay, do I have one more belt? Perfect. Okay, so this should start to work here very soon for us. It actually makes chips quite fast. Eight seconds to make a chip, four seconds to make two wire. Okay, that's actually not bad. 
And then how long does this take? One minute. Oh, 32 seconds, maybe? The one minute is to make all the stuff. Yeah, 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 to make all the stuff. We only need to make one. We just need to do the 32 seconds. There it goes. Yeah, it looks more like 32 seconds to me than two minutes, so that's good. That is going to make us laboratories, which is perfect. And then the only thing that we need to do next to start working on some more research. Should I be making some of this other stuff as well? Oh, I probably should be, but I just don't want to right now. Let's get the research going. Where is research? I guess I probably have to look for it in here. Research just takes a gear. That's it. It just takes a gear. So that's easy. That's actually quite easy. We just might need a few more iron smelters because this is going to become not very productive here very soon once I start turning all that in. But anyway, let's see how many of those we can get going. We need... Uh, what do we want? Should I make a module for that? Probably, right? Let's do it. Let's make a new module. Mm, module planner. Nothing's in here right now. Perfect. So we'll go here. We'll get a source. We will get a input. Um, that is just going to put right into a factory. And that is going to make us gears. And then that is going to get copied. Where do I want to put this? Directly into another factory. Which is going to make us science packs. Which is going to get output directly into an output. I hope. Hopefully that works. Now we are going to set this limit, I think, to a thousand, if we can manage. And then put this on stop once sinks reach their limit and put it on extra fast ticks. So it's going to tell us how far it's going to go. I should actually have this set to a thousand as well. Okay. So once we get a thousand input or output, we've already got the input limited to a thousand. I can go and I can put the divisor here to a thousand. We can set the number of ticks to however long this is going to take. It's going to be a big one. Oh my God. We're going to be in the one hour range. <laughs> Current time, one hour and three minutes. Okay, we're getting close. We're getting close. Bingo. Okay, so we need 256700 as the number of ticks. So let me make sure. 256700. So we're going to go into modularized ticks, change this to 256700, and then set the divisor equal to 1000. And that means the total time that it just took divided by 1000 is going to be the time it takes us to make one of these which should be good so this is a research tier one let's i'm hoping this is right let's modularize this research tier one enter creating the module let's go try it where are we so i take this and I put it in here. Uh, how am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? I don't have anywhere good to do this is the thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Maybe we can copy some of these. Give ourselves a little bit more room. That's going to be better. So now copy my, my little doohickeys. Orange is in. So we're going to do something like this. Can afford source chest. Oh, why does it still say a thousand here? I s did I not set the divisor on that thing? Did I forget? How do I edit that? Divisor. 
1,000. Set cursor to structure? Oh no, it says current 1,000. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it's just gonna work. So let's see. If I put one ingot in here... It is... Not going to... Oh, what the heck am I doing? It is not going to work. It is not good. Not good. Let's delete this. Are you sure you want to remove RT1? Yes. Because... Why is this not working? Current set to 1000. Set the divisor that should be used during modularize. Okay, let's try this one more time. Maybe I broke it last time. RT1. Is it working now? Hello? Let's see. Is it set to one now? Oh, <gasps> it's set to one now. Okay. There we go. So this should just start pumping out research. Perfect. Well, there we go. We're making research. That is exactly what we wanted. So now what we're going to need to do is start putting that research in to research labs. And hopefully we have at least one. We have 11 available already. What the heck? Okay. Well, that's going quicker than I thought it would. We can start putting these guys down. Like so. And we can copy this as many times as we want to get as much research as we want. And then we just have to go in here and figure out what we want next. What do we want? T two belt mixing. What's this? Tier two research. I don't know if we need tier two right now. Is that what, is that what we have to do for everything? Oh, long arms. Armors Mark 2 unlocks faster version of arm. That sounds good. Unlocks a new arm that can reach further. I kind of like that. Three belt mixing. Where's the splitters? Flow control. What's this? Plugins? Unlocks the plugin system. Okay. I think we kind of want to get into here, but that is research tier two, which I don't have right now. Where the heck are splitters? Is that what this is? Crossing mark two, two belt mixing. Is there no splitters in this game? Flow control. Structures that allow for splitting one belt into three. Okay. Ay, ay, ay. So we're gonna need this, I guess. We may as well do it now. Five out of a hundred. And we may as well just keep this going as far as we can here. If I need more research, I can always just add another laboratory. But I think for now, that is going to be okay. I hope. That's not bad. It's going pretty quick. We can add maybe a couple more without too much grief. I don't know if we're actually building these fast enough. Does it say how long it takes to use up one of these? 16 seconds to use one up and this thing's making one in four seconds so this thing can only really keep up with four it's going way faster than four seconds isn't it maybe it's not maybe that's about four seconds okay so we can actually only keep up with four of these things at a time approximately so i would need another system if i wanted to do all eight of these but I can't build it yet because I don't have the fancy little chest doohickeys. So what does this take? Four chips. Well, we can do that. I can start putting these up here into another system to make us these guys. Four chips. What does this one take? Also four chips. Okay, let's delete this actually move it over because then i can do this and we can have one for each of them perfect 
And we can take this same 30, put it in there, and give it a belt. There we go. So as this stuff starts to get full, it should start making the other ones. All that is fine and dandy. You'll love to see it. It's going to be a little bit slow, but for now, I think it's going to get us all of the stuff that we need to start being able to mass produce things, which is the main priority right now. We're already 50% of the way. This is so much faster than what we were doing before. <laughs> oh my God. Yep, definitely worth. Would recommend. I guess if I need to make this a little bit faster, we could do this. And that is about as fast. Actually, wait. I can make it even a little bit more faster if I put this like this. Can sneak just a little bit more out of these things. There we go. Okay, I think that's not bad. We can also... Do I want a crossing belt here? I feel like if I put a crossing belt here... Eh, I don't need it right now. We'll leave it. But we are going to need more power because we're already gassed out here. So let's just do something like that. And we're probably going to need even more power. Which I don't do right now. I can't do. Maybe I can. We got 29 extra furnaces. We can go to town here. Let's build a extra belt. And... This little area in here is going to be kind of a pain in the butt. A butt butt. We can put that there anyway. Let's delete all this. Delete that. And then... Oh no, we actually need this. No, that's going to work out perfectly. That's going to be absolutely perfect. Okay, we'll copy all these. In, 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 in. Like so. And if we need to, we can always copy and pasty. Why can't I copy the whole thing? There we go. Oh my god, yes. Yes, 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 yes. We can copy and pasty like that. Copy and pasty like this. Oh, now we're cooking with gas. Yep, that is what I am talking about. Okay, perfect. Well, if we end up needing more copper or more coal, I guess we could copy this like this and that will help out a little bit, but I don't need it just yet. I don't think. No, we've almost got the merging belts, which is great. I don't know exactly why we would need that because these belts basically merge by themselves anyway, but I'm sure we'll figure out what we're going to use them for at some point. But for now, that's looking pretty good. Maybe we should copy some more of these furnaces. We're probably going to need a few extra ingots here pretty soon. So let's copy a pasty like so. In, in, in. Out, out, out. In, in, in. All right. Well, that is going to get us just the... Well, it's going to almost double the amount of iron ingots we're pumping out, which is going to be useful. And I think, for the most part, this is all looking pretty good. Are we still making assemblers? Yes, we're making them. We've got 30 available. Oh, this is so good. Okay, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. We can keep expanding this up the farther and farther that we need to go. So we can just keep adding more power. Hopefully at some point we get the uh, ability to make better power. But for now, I think we're going to try and... Do we, should we prioritize this um, splitting belt? I kind of want to. I kind of want to because it's going to be important. So I think we're going to focus on it, but guys, I think we're also going to go ahead and wrap up this episode right there. We got so much done today. It's turning into some spaghetti, but I mean, for the most part, things are looking pretty good. We've got mass, produ mass production of almost 
all of the things that we're going to need to be able to expand at a greater and greater speed. I still don't have any sink chests available yet. We got one out of four chips in there. It seems like this guy is getting last priority out of this machine. Maybe I should just add a second one. What's the what's the problem? Hey, let's just do it. I'm going to do it. We can copy that up there. We can just delete this guy. And honestly, I should move all these as well so that this guy only feeds this thing. But I mean, we don't need any more laboratories. We got 30 available. We got 30 available? No, we got 16 available. Oh, I've got 30 of these things available. Right, when you hover over it, it says how many you have. Yeah, 16 laboratories available, which is fine. This thing's actually keeping up with the labs right now, somehow. Why? Oh, that's the brightness. That's not research. I thought this was research. So we can start researching something else like three belt mixing structures that allow for either splitting one belt into three. Oh, oh my God. Splitting one belt into three. Well, that's what we're looking for. Okay. Well, there we go. That's going to work out quite nicely. Anyway, I'm going to wrap it up right there, guys. I hope you are loving the series so far. If you are, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here and I will see you next time.